What's up everybody? Anthony here, SpecialtyMotorCars.net. It's winter time, so we're prepping cars for storage. One of those cars that I have to find space for is this big old beast behind me. I've had this thing for pretty much a year now and it's a cool car I've only used it twice so it's pretty much useless to me but I feel like I need to keep it around uh, the two times I did use it were for uh, good hearted functions drove uh, a World War II veterans family to a charity motorcycle run and uh, a couple of little odd things I did to it it's all dusty it's been in and out of my building in and out but basically inside uh, but I have to find a place to put this thing because I'm out of space inside Papa Bear is in the escalator over there uh, I'm going to take this up to a friend's shop or a friend's storage location fellow YouTuber here uh, up in Bedford, New Hampshire and we're going to see if we can squeeze this big fat fatty into his uh, garage with all his collection well some of his collecting cars is Papa Bear. What's up, Papa Bear? Hey, what's happening? You ready to drive this thing up there? I'm ready to follow you. Let's go. All right, so let's get this thing cranking here. Oh, laddie. Oh, and if you've never driven a limo. Oh, baby. Let her rip, tater chip. Yeah, this thing just fell off on me too. Now the cool thing about this car is whoever rides in the back feels badass. But the fun is only good for people in the back because you gotta sit up front and you kinda in like, I know these are big cars, but it's got this partition window behind me. And with that behind you, you're kinda sitting in an upright, I guess, you know, for a smaller person, obviously not me, uh, it's comfortable to drive, but I really, I don't know. I don't know how long I'll keep this car for. Maybe another year. I don't know, six months, springtime, sell it. I don't even know what this thing is worth. Who, who, <laughs> who buys limos? I have no idea. So, this is, he said it was a barn, and this is a barn. And his name is Big Al. So, what better... Is to name it Big Al's Toy Barn. Because Big Al keeps his toys in said barn. And Big Al's calling me. Let's see what Big Al keeps in his toy barn. Oh, oh look at this. Big Al's Toy Barn. What do we have? 95 Tauruses? There ain't no rear wheel drivers in here, Dad. This this beast will take over. Yeah. <laughs> a town car plus five and a half feet. What else is bad? Oh, look at how cobweb he is here. Oldsmobile Cutlass Wagon. Dodge Dynasty. Look at this thing. You don't see those things anymore. Port City. That was a local car. What's my? What's in the back? Uh, what's in the back? Oh, that's a Geo Metro. <laughs> That's a Geo Metro convertible. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. A tiny little Geo Metro. I think it's got a blown engine. I think he told me it, it doesn't run. Oh. So definitely a wise investment on his part to store that here. What else? Buick Century. Wow. Maybe I should have got a car cover. Man, these are like barn finds. What are you thinking? We're gonna fit? Well, it, it, it will fit in here, but very tight, Anthony. Oh, it's a big uh, fat ass thing gonna squeeze between this. We got a hook on the wall here. Some horseshoes. You wanna throw some horseshoes? Yeah. Get a maybe, ringer? Maybe some luck to. Like we'll, that? We won't get but ravaged. You don't wanna hit the roof or anything with that. What? This. Oh, yeah, that would fuck That's you. That's why up. I'm saying that. What is this? What is, what is the wires for? Look at it, it's got a wire, wire, goes to something. That See? must have been an alarm for this door. 
That's a fucking, oh, excuse me, that's a weird alarm. It's kind of weird, it's got three bays. Yeah, I know. So we gotta fit that limo in this spot, which it would, but we also gotta keep this inside. What are you thinking? If you get that in there, you'll have a little more room for this. Okay. Otherwise, you're just about gonna take up almost all the space. What do you think, we can stuff this underneath the car? No, if you get, if you get your limo in yeah. all the way, you might come close. This here, this here is probably... We could even cool. drive the limo up on top of this, you know. Well, I don't know. You can't do that in here. No. So, what you have to do is, you, you gotta get, it'd be better, I think, to get it over this side. Okay. All right, let's finagle. We're gonna finagle and see what we can figure out here to stuff this town car out of the way. Uh, if I can get it out of my shop for the winter and in this unused space, that would be quite nice and quite useful. So we're gonna jump a Ford to a Ford. This Taurus, he hasn't started or moved in quite some time. It's got power. It's got a lot of crap on it. It's actually in pretty nice shape. Lots of cobwebs. <laughs> you think it's gonna start? There's only one way to find out. Oh, you got the key. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Whoop! The hell was that? Don't know. It just chirped a little bit. Ugh. Got an aftermarket code alarm. Whoa! Is right. Sounds like a top. A Ford Taurus top. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised. You don't see these things anymore. And these are cool. They got the uh, radio knobs, like the seat button and the volume up here, like the old sables. Taurus. What's the mileage on this thing? 22,000? Knowing Big Al, it's probably. 122, but it's actually quite nice shape. Maybe it is 22. All right, what are we doing here? Three meters. Really cobwebs here. I'm gonna slide my butt across. Should we take these guys off? Oh, we only have to back it up a little. We'll leave it. Whew. I don't want to kill his alternator. Ugh. I got a seatbelt up my ass. Oh, that's a problem. Ooh, oh, there we go. Broke free. You watch behind me. That's what she said. Whew. Got some valve cover oil burnage going on here. What do we got? The space now. We back up against the... Uh... Nice, look at that, Dad. Like butter. Yeah. Let's see if we can get the big fat fatty inside now. Baby, she's a chirper. It's like the kit car. You need to get the uh, thing they were in here next. What? Look 
like butter. Oh, I see. Yeah, in this car. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it could go over a little bit more, but you, you really want to. Yeah. I, I got you. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're close. We are close. So, now we got to get this thing back in here. Okay, do over. We put this in first up against the wall. You can see where my tire is literally right at the tongue. Originally, we tried to get the limo in and then sneak this in the door, but the wheel wells are just as wide as the door and we just couldn't spin it. All right, let's try this again. putting her away she's got 199 miles fuel range 67,000 miles gonna shut it off disconnect the battery I got some mice deterrent oh, that's reminding me to pop the hood Whew. we fit this is a much better idea I straightened the limo out so we didn't wedge it big Al could probably put another Geo Metro back here Look at this. Oh, yeah. I owe him big time. Disconnected, Pops? Disconnected. We got my plate off of it? No. Uh, you took yes. It? Yes, we did take the plate off. Okay. This worked perfect. Great idea. Some space for another Geo Metro, probably. A couple of motorcycles up in the middle. Let's set some uh, mouse bait. All right, we got some mouse traps by the wheels. Some of them sticky traps on the inside of the wheels. And then these little stink bags here. Hopefully to deter the meeses. There you go, all thanks to Big Al's Bike and Auto. We have the key, where's the key? What do I do with the key? Think so? Right. Yep. Goodbye, limo. See you in the spring, hopefully. Yeah, I got crap all over me, I got crap all over you. Ooh. Crap. Holy cow. Holy crap. Holy crap. <laughs> Ooh, that feels good. Hey, hey, <laughs> cut that out. Right. Look at all the crap on you. Oh, was I sleeping like you? Sleeping on the ground in the barn. Should have been feeding the animals, Papa Bear. <laughs> all right, let's rock and roll. Next, let's go look at that other Cadillac. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What other Cadillac? <laughs> close by? It's close by. Between it's got 19,000 miles. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. We're going to go look at it now all right. while we're here. That all right? That's fine with me. <laughs> well, you're local. Get rid of one. Let's go buy another one. Yeah, that's the way it always works. Not gonna, you. not gonna tell you what kind of car it is. We'll see if I can get it bought first. But by the time you see this video come out, I'll probably own it anyways. But uh, want to give a big shout out. 
to Big Al's Bike and Auto. Link in the description. Check out his page. Uh, he is like the opposite of me when it comes to Cadillacs or GMs. He's front wheel drive and I'm rear wheel drive. <laughs> but he's got a, a lot of cool videos. Anyways, thanks Big Al. Appreciate it. The toy, toy bond is officially full. Uh, everybody, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you soon.